at Google Stop Music, please. Yeah, let's go up there. You want to go up there? I was just sitting up there the other day. I cleaned out some of the pollen. Let's go sit in the swings. Okay, come on. You got some water up there? Some cold water. Yeah, there's some water up there. Hey, Radiance. What's up, friend? Oh! We just having a little conversation. Thought I'd come live for a minute. This probably be deleted. I don't know. Um, if you are on my Patreon or my members only, I just posted a, a whole cook with me video. And I cook, I'll show you what I cook real quick. Hey Google, turn on kitchen. Show y'all what I cook real quick. I already separated it into little bowls. I did some uh, shrimp, cucumber. I guess they call it a weight loss salad. I don't know, but it's shrimp, cucumber, avocado, um, tomato, onion, lime juice, lemon juice. I'll leave it up. Oh, and Josh is here. Say hey, Josh. Hello, how you doing, everybody? My roommate Josh is here. <laughs> You were just watching it. I wanted to premiere it. Oh, dang. I wanted to premiere it. You can't eat that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you can't eat it. I can eat it, though. <sighs> Get my little exercise in. How many steps is that? You let them know that you your cookbook coming? <laughs> yes, my cookbook will be here in the spring summer. Fall of September, spring, summer. <laughs> I left my fresco. No, thank you. Come on, we can't cool off outside. It's very light and very delicious. <sighs> Eating a turkey sandwich. The ingredients I posted it on the on the um members only tab. But if you got a pen and paper, I'll tell you right now. You were just watching it. I wanted to premiere it. That's why I'm kind of mad because then I realized I couldn't premiere it without it being public. But I think there was a right way around it. I have put my little fairy lights around so at night they come on. The little, you see the little wire right there? Yeah. What is that? They solar lights. They for my skills. I said solar lights. Do they kill my skills? No, they don't kill nothing. No. They just light up. I like so I They said, are you okay, Josh? I'm all right. I'm hanging in here. You look tired. You know, Biggie does not like being outside. I don't know what his problem is today. Biggie, what is your problem? He hiding behind the plant. He cutting up. So, um, this is real cute. You think that's real cute? We just be sitting out here talking to him. You only saw the announcement. It said Josh got some muscular legs. Biggie. You didn't see that Patreon? It said Patreon. It's a Patreon. I posted it just a little while ago, Cheryl. I think I posted it. I guess I posted it. Princess AG, is it in Patreon for him? I don't know why he always wanna go back in the house. Where is he going? Something wrong with my dog. Big, stop. Um lemongrass oil drops in a water bottle keeps mosquitoes away okay do you know what today is it's our anniversary is it 
Thank you, Vail B. Shout out to Vail B. I told y'all it was in Patreon. I actually gave it to everybody in Patreon. Normally, I just give it to tier two and above. I gave that. <laughs> Don't get cursed out out here. It ain't even hot. My dog don't like to be hot. It ain't even hot out here. Uh-uh. Look at this dog. It ain't even hot. And now he, he's a full of drama. Now he starts shaking like he burned Where you up. going? Yeah. Jeez. Um, outside of the prenup, does Portia have any rights to the house if it was bought before the marriage? I don't think so, Tasha Washington. I was actually, you know what? We need to talk about that tonight. I'm going to show you when we get offline. I wish I could pull it up. I do have two phones. But I was watching a, one of them court shows on YouTube. And it was this man. He married this girl who used to work at Hooters. <laughs> and they bought a house together. He put the bulk of the money down on the house. The difference between this situation and Portia and them situation is this girl had her name on the deed. But um, anyway, he moved out the house. She moved her mama in. She had a baby by like two different men or whatever. And so like his lawyer was grilling her like, have you paid any money towards the mortgage? Do you do this? Do you do this? She let her 10 year old son play like drive the car down the driveway and ran over some shrubbery. And it just anyway, long story short, from what I saw, it was like an hour long. I only watched like 30 minutes of it. The judge wasn't having it. She's going she gonna to make that, that lady move out. Mm -hmm. So, this was a different situation, but I'm thinking that it, it could equate to... I don't know. But but Simon and Portia have a prenup, so he's going to have to like prove that she signed a prenup under false pretenses. Like, she, she didn't go into the marriage. With clear intentions. Yeah, with clear intentions. So... Mm -hmm. uh, you hit a bee, a beehive with your broom on the balcony. Oh no, Cheryl, don't do that. We don't have no bees out here today. You, you know, uh, my friend Stephanie, who always send us good stuff. Oh no, you got pollen on your, on your shoulder. But um, don't be getting sick, Josh. You know how you get. Okay. I thought I had cleaned out all the pollen, but still something up there. Yeah, mask and blow it. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, you know our friend Stephanie that be sending us all the cute stuff, but sending me all the cute stuff that you be trying to take all the time. Uh huh. She sent me some industrial strength insect swatters. Oh, hell no. Yeah, that's so, what we gonna use on bees today. Yeah, I should, <laughs> but you know, for them big ass bees. Uh -huh. Oh, they swallow. Yeah. Oh, I ain't think about that. Yeah, hit them like a tennis ball. Oh, wow. Yeah. I want to try it. Go get it. It's on. It's on. You feel like walking around? I want to go get it. Where'd it be at? Go get one. They be. They don't fly around here in a minute. They on the. Um. They on the table in the living room. I forgot to bring them up here. I need to go down there and get my fresco. That fresco was good. Cold. We're not talking about nothing. We're just sitting out here. I just literally, I, I'm really frustrated because I just spent two hours of my life <laughs> editing that Cook With Me video and I was going to premiere it and I was going to sit. I had scheduled a little time aside to sit and talk to y'all in the chat while I cook my little cucumber salad that I did last night. I actually did it. You want your ass whooped. Cause you was not going in this house. No, I actually, <laughs> I actually did it before the live last night. And so I was going to premiere it, but I had to cut some stuff out. Cause I had got a phone call in the middle of it. I think it's got some music playing, whatever, whatever. So it's not monetized, but that's why I put it on members only. And, um, yeah, it was an hour long. It only took me an hour to make a little salad. I, I cooked the shrimp, cut up all the cucumbers and the onions and the avocado, mix it all together. It's actually better today. It's better on the, like the second day, honestly, because then like the lime juice and lemon juice all like marinate. It's good. I love me a good cucumber salad. 
You heard that Andy Cokehead is gone from the Housewives. You heard that, Joshua? No, I ain't heard that. I ain't heard that yet either. Everybody else gone, though. Robin gone. Candace gone. But I don't watch them like that. Candace pregnant. I ain't never watched the episode of them, to be honest. Somebody else gone from Beverly Hills. Don't look at my toes. I know they ugly. My feet are nice. I'm not looking at it. I don't know. I'm looking at you talking. I'm so, look, I'm so insecure about my toes right now. I need to go get my toes. You need a pedicure. That's what makes I need a pedicure. pedicure bad as hell. I couldn't get with that. With my toes. With I need a pedicure. You a boy. It don't matter about your toes. <laughs> I look like I've been outside <laughs> kicking flowers. <laughs> kicking rocks, honey. I was going to go today. I, I told you I went yesterday. And they were closed. Yeah. Me and Josh was gonna ride by the um, Kenya Moore hair care. <laughs> See if they open. But I'm trying not to be petty. I'm trying not to be petty. No, no, what they call this research. Research. I need. I'm doing content. I need to do content. Uh, yes. Yeah, looking like twelve years of play. Looking like junkie Dineva feet. <laughs> Go sit down. <sighs> anyway, the people hadn't called me about my car yet. Now I can't even track it. They didn't cut me off the app, because you know with your, like with a Tesla or a Tycoon or any of the electric cars, you can track it with your phone. They didn't cut off my, my thing. I don't know where my car is. They could have shipped my car to Europe somewhere. He said, Sherelle World Post reported that Andy has stepped down from Watch What Happens Live. What? Hold on. Why is my mama calling me? Hello? 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 Does she not know she called me? My mama be butt down me. Uh, did your mama be butt down you? <laughs> She just be calling. My mama mean to call. She be just be calling my ass. My mama be butt down with me all day long. And then I be like, did you just call me? I did not call you. And I'm like, I'm looking at the phone ring. Uh, you said you would be so happy if Andy got fired. I guess for all those lawsuits, he's a liability. He is. Now she ain't answering the phone, but you literally just called me, Mama Brown. Uh, Sherelle's info is normally accurate. I like Sherelle's world. Yeah, but I don't know about him stepping down. But I don't know about him stepping down either. <laughs> I mean, anything's possible. It's time, honestly. Yes, I heard that Candace was pregnant and she announced it. They got a little video on YouTube if you look it up. They announced it. Uh, shout out to my new member. Hold on, who is that? What did they say? Welcome, Gail, to, to the AT Alien Squad. Hope you enjoyed my cooking video I posted today. I normally don't cook in public. <laughs> I'm not, you, you know, I'm not one of them domestic goddess type people. I like doing little stuff, though. I like plants. I just bought that plant. It's about to die, though. But I'm about to repot it. Um, I like plants, and I like um, electronics. And I like shoes and clothes, but that's a whole nother thing. Uh, Velby said, my mom does the same thing. Then don't answer, but okay. I'm like, is it me? She literally just called me. Y'all heard the phone ring. Then I call her back. She don't answer. She probably looking at this live like, oh, I didn't know you was live. Hey, darling. Oh, now he, now he being good, Josh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He realized I am not opening the door. Uh, when they first said she was leaving, I said she was probably pregnant. Oh, okay. Yeah, them shows do be stressful. Um, Candace is 13 weeks. Oh, that's so nice. Congratulations. Hey, C. Patterson, Prince of AG. Michelle, did you see where they use your own star information? To rate your insurance without your permission. You know what they do? I believe that. I believe that. But you know what they do? Because my insurance went up. And I think it was because I be speeding. 
No, but you know, like the Allstate app mm -hmm. have have that drive wise thing on it, and it'll literally tell you everywhere you go how fast you was going if you was on the phone. Or you had it on your phone. Yeah, I need to delete it. Don't I know, Dan. Well, you got that like on your phone. You know, I can't have it on my phone. You know how I drive. I know, but I mean, I thought you know it's normally the app you go to just to pay your insurance. Oh. But it within the app, it's a little drive wise thing, and it tr it tracks your phone. And then I went through it, and it showed me like everywhere I had been. Oh no! Hold on. What is that? I'm gonna show you. I'm not gonna show y'all, but I'll show you. Georgia went up. Okay, my homeowners went up. I'm like, the hell? Now my mom called me back. Hey. I'm alive. Oh, you had just called me. Because you called me. Okay. You didn't, you didn't, did you mean to call me? Yeah, but I didn't know you was online. Oh, okay, do you need me? No. Why are you trying to hang up on me? You call me now. You want to, I thought you said you was on live. I am. You on live too. You don't want me to talk to you on live. You can talk to me while I'm on live if you want to. Just well, don't, don't say nothing incriminating. Hmm. I'm just calling you back. That's all. I, I thought you didn't call. Me. They put pink hearts in the chat for you, Mama Brown. Well, I sure appreciate that. Cause I don't feel good. <laughs> my back hurts. Oh no, not your back hurting. It's it's, it's the weather. Cause <clears throat> I think it's my arthritis. It's like an aching, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm just aching. So I'm okay though. Well, I hope you feel better. Eat you something good for lunch. Well, I just ate some bowl of potato soup. Potato soup. <laughs> that don't sound good. It was good. It had bacon chips and cheese in it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. Everybody's praying for you to feel better. I feel better. It's just my back just hurting today. Um, but it's not real bad. I mean, it's, it's like my arthritis. It's like an achy, achy. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll talk to you later. All right. Sorry I interrupted your life. Oh, it's no problem. Anytime for you. Baby, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> yes, for the potato soup, honey. I don't know. I was gonna show you this uh this drive thing. Well, I'm looking at mine. Make sure mine don't be saying. You should. Person. You are all state. Who you with? I'm with a state farm. Look, state farm just is dead. Look. I'm so to you see that drive wise right there? Uh -huh. Now look, look. Watch this. Hold on. Let me go in here. Okay, so it got sudden braking, high speeds. Oh, they gonna give me, oh, they say I got some money though. They say I got a 7% projected policy credit. Okay, look at it, look at it. Y'all can't see it. But all of this, they are taking inventory of the thing. Look, view all trips. Okay, look at it, look at it, look at it, look at it, look at this. I went to CVS, they got me going to CVS oh, right there. Hell no. Oh, no, ma'am. Look, look, look. They got me going from Atlanta to Clark. <laughs> oh, no, ma'am. Look, high speeds and braking. No, ma'am. And phone activity. Oh, not phone activity. Yes, oh, Charles. No, that's Russia. Nuh uh. This, this illegal. This should be illegal. Look, this on uh, April 15th. Where I went from? Oh, it said no sudden braking, no high speeds, and no phone, no phone activity. Keep up the safe driving. Oh, baby. I just deleted mine. Uh-uh. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh-uh. Let me see when I drove to Memphis. I know they got some high speeds when I <laughs> Oh, look at that. Look at that long trip right there. That's crazy. It's that high speeds. That is crazy. <laughs> Hell no. But you get edited and you can say you're the passenger, and but then I'll be the passenger each and every time. Then they add on, you need an extra driver. Yes, I have the drive-wise by Allstate, Rodolfo. But they do give you money back. Like, I got like $400 back last time. I don't know what I'm going to get back this time. But you can operate your whole car from your phone. So, they got all your information. Okay. No, I'm just here. You ain't got to tell me. I will check my email. That 7% go right to the taxes, okay? 
They do. They do. And then I got three cars. You can't drive all three cars. I feel like insurance should be cheap if you got three cars. It's your, the insurance, the insurance should apply to you. <laughs> so, I mean, you know, being that I'm single and ain't nobody driving my cars but me. I think whatever car that I get in should be insured to the fullest because I'm in it. Okay. I hear what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? I hear it. So, in, if I'm not in it, then it's just in the garage, right? Oh, what if they only charge you for the day you use your car? That would be better for you. Okay, but that's that's still kind of the same. If I'm in the car, I'm using it, right? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So, it should only apply to when I'm in the car and when I'm driving So, the you car. should get a, a driver's break. So, if you're in the car, you only get charged for that day that you use that car and you actually need an insurance. Yeah, maybe, yeah. Okay. We need to be insured. Insurers. Yeah, we need to go and write. Insurance is a scam, though. Think about all the money you pay for insurance and all, all the claims years. you don't file. And, and if you claim, file a claim, then they, then they drop you. <laughs> you no, file like a claim, it's a legal it goes scam. Up. It's yes. a legal scam. It, it really is. You need to work, work for the state farm. Because you pay more money for insurance than, you pay, than they pay out. Correct. It's a legal scam. Hmm. I do. I have my homeowner's insurance under the same company. So I have my homeowners and all my cars. I had my uh, a landlord and all that stuff when I had the other house and stuff. But yeah, everything was under the same policy. So I had a ton of discounts. According to them, my discounts would be like $4,000 over the, you know, like because I got discounts on the cars, discounts for this, discounts. And then I pay mine every six months. And I'm old, be lying. I pay mine every six months too, and I pay all of it. Yeah, they don't give me no discount. Mm. Oh, lying ass hoe. They I'm drop a... you or deny if if, if, if it's yeah. not covered. Okay. Vehicle, home, and health is a scam. Okay. Don't even get me started about health insurance. I'm mad at them right now. Sending me a, a bill for a thousand dollars for my colonoscopy. Oh, that's some bullshit. Yes. That's maintenance. They told me I had to pay my um. What is it? Not my deductible, but my um premium. Huh? You know how you go and you pay your copay? Yeah, my copay. I pay my copay. And then I got a bill like two, three months later. I got a bill from the dentist the other week for twenty dollars and I pay my copay. Girl, if you think you're gonna get it, good luck. Not twenty dollars. Twenty dollars? And I paid my copay while I was there. What the hell are you getting me twenty dollars for? You ain't getting it. You had a car repair insurance from Allstate too. It helps cover engine, transmission, wheels, and whatnot. I used to have it, Rodolfo. When I, I told him to take that shit out of my car. I said, I can afford my own tires. <laughs> now, on the new car, they put all of that stuff on there. And I didn't realize they had all that stuff on there. And I was like, no, take it off. Send me my money back. I don't need no, no rim insurance, no tire insurance. I don't need that. Baby. I can afford some tires if I want some. Okay. And if you Maybe. want to get the rims done, hey, get them damn reshaped. Recover. That costs too much. But to get your uh, rims. The, the powder coated like the new, the, um, like the old car. Yeah. It was, it was like $700 or something. Send the bill to my medical insurance. I told him to rebuild it. I did. I told him to rebuild it. And here we are. My, my colonoscopy was in November. Here we are in April. I'm still getting bills for it. Yeah. They don't. They better not send to collections because as hard as I done worked on my credit. No, no, that's gonna piss you off. Now, Mister Man Hands was calling me a monkey. Uh -uh. Not a monkey calling somebody a monkey. Let me stop. I don't care what Mister Man Hands call me. It's he's listen. He wakes up crying every day. <laughs> I can't even look. I feel sorry for Mr. Man Hands, honestly. Uh, Michelle, does your new car have air or nitrogen in the tires? Good question. Josh? No, I don't know. Like, I remember back in the day, it used to have nitrogen in my other car. But I don't, you know, as many times I got it fixed, I don't know what they be putting in the car. I don't be like, can you put nitrogen in there? I don't be saying. Anyway, uh, man hands home decor. Look at me. <laughs> See, y'all be trying to draw me in, and I was gonna do a home review of it. 
That would be funny. That would have to be on Patreon. Yeah, that yeah. might have to do it on Patreon. It yeah. looks like a clown house, honey. That would have to be on um, members on the top. Black tier. and red and yellow and child. who do who does that? But I mean, you know, maybe he played for the Falcons. <laughs> Oh, sorry, that was true. How he play? He probably did play for the Falcons. A linebacker. Yeah, I can see him being a linebacker because he's definitely not a tight end. A linebacker. He is a linebacker, honey. He's a footballer. Um, That's funny. I'm trying to find it. It was in my. It was in my thing. Yeah, I want to try to be shady. That was funny. That was funny. <laughs> if he played for the Falcons. That's why they always be losing. <laughs> All that junk in the trunk, he can't even run. Here you go, right here. Here you go, right, Joshua? Wait. Uh-uh. Hell no. Nah. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, that was like a Falcon house, doesn't it? Why well, tile in the living room? That's bathroom towel all over the. He got bathroom towel all over his. Uh, Chief, well, you know when you go to discount liquidation warehouse and you get a couple pallets. But I digress. As you how said. you gonna put bathroom towel all over the first floor? But if he like it, I love well, it. Well, they say we ain't got no house, we do. <laughs> they go out. We ain't got this. I ain't got, got nothing. nothing. Let them. Okay. I ain't got. I live in a nothing. box, honey. I ain't got. <laughs> nothing. I don't know nothing about interior decorating. Clearly, I don't know it because I paid somebody who ain't do what they supposed to do. <laughs> no. I don't know nothing about no interior decorating at all. Uh, Michelle, please share how to make cucumber salad. It is in my members only for only one ninety nine. I put it to all the members. You heard big and fill until you yell at him. Huh. You heard big and feelings yeah. He was hurting my feelings by scratching at my door. Okay, you about that painting. <laughs> I didn't get the outside painting. You did. The you inside did. was. Uh, it still looks better than. <laughs> you know what, Swirl Girl? I ain't gonna even. I ain't even mad at you. It it does. It does. It's not worth what I paid, but it looked better than uh, T.S. Manhand's house. But it's not a competition. If he like it, I love it. Uh, you got your credit to 800 and FICO to 779 out of 10. Child, Miss Barbara, I did too, child. I'm so happy to have good credit. I don't know what to do. I don't even know how to act. Back like, here. I don't think I would have been able to, to, to manage my credit like 10 years ago. You know, my mind wouldn't have been the same. Like, I would have been like buying a whole bunch of stuff I ain't really need. Now I'm scared or, to fuck it up. I don't want to put nothing up there. Yeah. I ain't got it. Look, as soon as I get a bill, I let me go and pay this. Yep. <laughs> Thank you, Michelle Miller. I appreciate it. You know, Megan Express offered me a payment plan. What is the planet? I do it all the time. Oh, I didn't know that. Good. I ain't know nothing about it. Just because I, I just want to pay it. Especially when I put like a lot of, like, you know, when I had got my car wrapped and stuff, it was like a lot. Okay. So I spread it out for six months. I ain't even know nothing about that. Yeah, and it, and it's cheap. Like you don't have to. It just depends. If you want to go ahead and pay, just go ahead and pay it. But it's like no interest, and they give you like a flat rate per month. So it might be like ten dollars a month. But my my special was zero a month. Yeah, for six months or whatever. So I just spread. I'm like, okay, it ain't costing me nothing. Right, right, right. So it just depends on like your standing, where you are, your credit report. They'll give you like a different rate depending on all of that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, MX for Planet is, is great. I love it. I ain't know nothing about it until yesterday. Mm -hmm. I ain't know nothing about that. And you know you get a free flight thing, a companion pass? Yeah. Okay, so you for, only, for the Delta one, yeah. You can only use it one time. What, the companion? Once a year. One Delta fan. Yeah. Okay. I didn't use mine this year. I ain't, got, I ain't, use, I ain't use mine either. I just looked at my thing and saw it. Huh. I didn't know that that's what it came with. I need to close that account, though. I don't even use it since they took away all the um, benefits uh, for, for the uh, lounge. Yeah, <clears throat> but you just get the real, um, not the real, but you know what I mean, the the real MX Platinum instead of the Delta one, and and it takes care of everything. You ain't gotta worry about it. So get the MX Platinum and the MX Gold. You do the MX Gold for um for supermarkets and all that stuff and, and food and Uber Eats because it gives you four times oh, the points. Like yeah, you gotta get to go. Okay. Gotta so get, we to get to go. 
deal. And you get the platinum, and you could get all those perks too, like the free um clear, the free Walmart Plus, mm. the free uh Hulu, and all that stuff. So yeah. Anyway. Pass you that ticket. You want you want my ticket? You can have a ticket. I gotta pay a ticket. I'm trying to decide if I wanna go to court if I wanna pay it. But I ain't going back to Alabama. Hi James. I was live last night, friends. We need us a charcuterie board. Uh, we do. Josh don't wanna eat nothing because he on the diet. I don't eat that kind of stuff. What do you mean you don't eat that kind of stuff? I do not eat all that cheese and olives and bullshit. What you mean? Wait a minute, let me get the phone up. I made some shrimp salad. I don't want no steam or saute shrimp. I like my fried dye and laid to the side. You don't like the, this deep fried? The cucumber salad? No, ma'am. You don't eat shrimp cocktail and stuff no. like that? No. Josh, what? Really? No, I don't want that. Uh, thank you. Appreciate it. When I did the um the what you call it video, I, I that was before I had put on my makeup. <laughs> when I did the uh the cook with me video, yes, Josh loved it. That's what he said when I told him I had made the the, the um the cucumber salad. Talk about you didn't make no pork show. Okay, that's what I'm looking for. He wants a pulled pork, honey. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. I don't want no damn shrimp salad. I'm like, you're supposed to be supporting me on my weight loss journey. I'm supporting journey. you. How is that supporting me? I'm also eating a high protein like steak. Pork. We eat steak all the time. That's what you should have cooked. That red meat going to get you, Joshua. Bro, you ain't cooked the grill all year. I haven't yet. But the year just started. What are you talking about? That's fine. You cook do it one time, too. Put some steaks on the grill. I want to come over here and do a cooking for Emma. I got, you know, I got an apron and everything and a chef hat. <laughs> I got a chef hat and an apron, and I'm coming over here. Okay, what you gonna cook? I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna cook steak, <laughs> toss salad, mm -hmm. and baked potato. That's what you gonna cook? Yeah, you know, I'm gonna grill you some shrimp. You want that kind of, you want shrimp? I ain't gonna eat nothing, but I grill you. You gonna grill me some shrimp? I'm gonna grill you some shrimp. This ain't really cooking. You ain't gotta like mix nothing up. Oh, by the time I, see, I season my stuff and I <laughs> put my stuff in that pan, that was, that's it. Oh, man. And you know, my salad better than Fox Brothers. Mm -hmm. I put bagel seasoning on my salad. I don't know about oh, that. Oh, it's good. Friend, when I tell you, it's. Okay, well, when are we gonna do this? You need to bring all of the ingredients. All the ingredients. I'm gonna come you over gonna Uber eat them? All right, uh, Instacart, all Instacart the ingredients. Instacart ingredients. Okay. And then I'm gonna come over here and we just gonna do a live. We can do a cook off if you want. <laughs> Not a cook off. <laughs> invite, invite one of your friends over and be the judge. Okay. Let's okay. start doing cooking with Michelle. Okay. Mm -hmm. The grill is down on the first floor patio. So the first week is me. You need to have your list of guests. Uh -huh. Me, Derek, Jake can cook. Uh, Derek okay, can invite Derek. Derek. You can mm -hmm. cook one day. Christian. Week. Christian. Who else? Tasha. Uh, okay, Tasha can cook. Yeah. She don't give me she can cook. She can make like well, she make a, She cook like me. A steam rocket. I can cook occasionally. She no, can you can cook. cook. Yeah. Christy. Christy, okay. Christy be baking. Oh, she gonna make some brownies. She make cakes and stuff. Yeah, she can bake yeah. She'll bring the dessert. Okay. Rice Krispies by Krispies. They said, can I cook, Josh? No, you can cook. <laughs> she can cook. I go ahead and wear her shit out. She'll cook. I'm like, go ahead every day. But I, I don't cook every day. I cook like once a month. Mm. You know. Hmm. Let's have a cook-off. So let's do that. Alright. What's the drink of choice? What we drink? We get, you can be What today or just in general? No. When we cook, we'll have make a cocktail too. Do a cocktail and do a dish. We can use our little cocktail machine, uh -huh. the Stephanie Bob. Yep, we can use the cocktail machine. Um, I'm so glad that there's um, leaves on the tree. Them leaves came back quick, didn't it? Last time we was up here, there no leaves on the trees, and you can see Ooh. everybody's house. Now that You're the right. leaves up, you can't see nobody else's house, so You're I right. like it up here now. It's more private. You don't got this one. Put some lashes on. This from last night. I slept up. <laughs> <laughs> they may fall off. Normally they fall off, but since they didn't fall off, I kept them on. Yeah. My 
when they fall off, they gone. I ain't putting them back on no more. Sangria, sangria. Ooh, yes. Can sangria. you make a homemade sangria? Throw some little apples and peaches and stuff in there. Yeah, let's do some peaches. Uh-huh. Uh, pears. It's good sangria. Mm -hmm. uh, a couple orange slices. Oh, okay. You fancy. Mm -hmm. There he is, trying to get that dough in there. Biggie. Biggie. It's okay, baby. It's okay. I know you want to go with you. It's okay, baby. Biggie, you need a haircut. Big, you wanna go outside? We outside. We outside, ragamuffin. Lord, baby. He need to be in the house on the couch laying down. Hey, this that's our every day. It's nap time. It's three. It's three fifty nine. It is nap time. We will be sleep right now. Why is he? Why are you up here so early? <clears throat> we can go wherever. Are we riding to the salon to see if it's open? You want to? I mean, I'm interested in seeing if it's open. It's not open on a Tuesday. Come on now. You gonna drive? I'm gonna drive. It don't matter. You want me to drive? I don't care. You wanna drive? It don't matter. Do I have the phone closed? Huh? Do I have the phone closed? What do you have the phone closed for? Look at me. And I got pollen all over me. What the hell? I'm going. Uh, I don't really give a fuck how I look. It's the middle of the week. I'll be honest. Yeah, we're gonna we gonna rock. But they ain't gonna know how we are. No, you know how to go the long way. Yeah. <laughs> that ain't not. You know how to go the long way. You know what I'm Get in the house. Hold on, I need a bear. It ain't nothing up here for Coke and Mountain Dew. So you got your fresh for downstairs? Gonna be cold. Come on, Biggie, let's go. Every time I leave it, do I always think about that? I said you had it open for a couple of days. It was open for a couple of days. I don't be coming up here. And then I looked on the camera. I was like, is that door open? That door is open. Don't look at my bedroom. It's a mess in there. Tell Josh to make, oh, they said you need to make an appointment at Kenya More Hair Spot for finger waves. Uh-uh, I'm going to some crimp curls. Some crimp curls? Marcel's my scalp. No. Yeah, I'm going to Marcel's. <sighs> it is cold down here. Hey, Google, play music on the, oh, no, don't do that. Hey, Google, turn off kitchen. I wear my Crocs. Think somebody gonna see me? Yeah, don't wear them. Why I can't wear my Crocs? Don't wear them Crocs. <sighs> you ain't getting that comfortable. Well, mm -hmm. Lord, don't wear them Crocs. What you talking about the outcast Crocs? Why I can't wear that? Uh -huh. I ain't going. I ain't getting out the car. Well, if you go run to the store, door and pull on the door. My my toes ain't that though. I got what am I wearing? Well, let me see the Crocs. Well, you can't done well. Wear the Crocs. If this was one of the Crocs, I'd have two shoes. Wear the damn Crocs. I got to throw the towel. What's wrong with Crocs? <clears throat> I, I, I think you're discriminating against me. Y'all know wealthy women if all they wear their ass Crocs. Ah, uh, don't. Don't do that. Do, 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 uh, women of leisure. That's because he said you're on a women of leisure. Oh, I forgot to put Biggie. Biggie. Well, he can stay out. Mm -hmm. This is a woman of leisure. I can wear these. That's yeah, ugly, yeah. too. They don't match. My toes ain't done. That's the problem. I can't wear nothing. My toes ain't done. So, Crocs cover my toes. Okay, what are your Crocs? I can wear them slides right there with them studs on them. Them Louboutin looking things. No. No, where you crossed it. Uh -huh. We'll be driving a Porsche truck, the Porsche car, my car. What you want to drive? 
Let me drive the truck. You can drive. I ain't got to physically drive it. But. You can drive. I don't care. It ain't my car. Let me, about to, uh, Let me get my purse. Let me about to drive it. We're going on a field trip. We're going on a field trip. I don't know what we're doing. I love Fresca. Ain't got no calories in it. It's good. We're going on a field trip. I gotta make sure, I don't know, one of my phones, hold on y'all, let me make sure this phone is linked to this phone, so I won't get cut off. Hold on, be right back. Can y'all hear me? I'm back, can y'all hear me? Press one if you can hear me, if I need to come out. Press one if you can hear, okay, good. I had to connect my own. Um... Oh. I don't know which car I'm driving. Looks like a used car lot over here. Should I drive the old Porsche or the new Porsche? What's up, Polo Man? Or the Jeep. The Jeep haven't been driven in months. <laughs> Should I drive the old car? I need some WD-40 on that garage, that's for sure. Oh, the Macan. You like that Macan? Yeah, I like them. I got a new little phone holder, too. Let me get the little phone holder. Yeah, that's Biggie. Yeah, that's Biggie, child. He'll be all right. Move, dog. Hold on. I got a little phone holder I bought. Let me see if it work in this car. Go sit down somewhere. Go, go lock it down. Go, go back upstairs. Go. I'll be back. So which car am I driving? Are you driving? My car. Yeah. My car. You gonna drive? Yeah, I drive. Get out of the garage, bye driver. Get out of the garage, you get out of the garage. Yeah, I can, but I'll just, you know, let your house, I guess, to like, Okay, you ain't gonna hit nothing, are you? No, I'm gonna Okay. 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 it's dirty. Not on it. Well, it's dirty on the outside. Y'all want to drive that Jeep? It's dirty. What you think, Jeep? Ain't nobody gonna do all that. I don't feel like doing all that. Take it to the car wash. <laughs> pull it, pull it out, pull it out. Go to the hand wash. I took uh the old car to the hand wash yesterday. It's a beautiful day out. Drive through the car car wash. Drive the new. I want to drive the car that ain't mine. <laughs> this my old car. I love her. This car has held me down through thick and thin. She ain't going nowhere. That's good. That's been not hitting me. Yeah, the wrap came out nice. I'm excited about the wrap. It came out really nice.
They saying Josh be careful. Now you gotta do a, a 15 point turn. Don't show the license plate. It's not my car. It's the dealer's car. So that's the only license plate you saw. It was the dealer's car. Yes, they say a 10 and 2 because you're carrying precious cargo now. We got this. He got it. He got it. You want me more car? Huh? You want me more car? Oh, yeah, you might need to move it. Why they got all them cars out here? They're doing a damn car wash. <laughs> My neighbors had too many cars, child. Like I'm one to talk. <laughs> My neighbor got to got all his cars lined up down the street. <sighs> okay, how I do that? Hold on. How I take you off the camera? Hold on. It's not like um what you call it when that's why I put it in my lap. It's not like uh what you call it when you could turn off the camera. I could just flip it. That's all I can do is flip it. I just flip it. Um, you said your neighbors had too many too? Okay. You can see my house. Okay. Put me in the Google's chat. Um, thank you so much, Soundress. I appreciate it. Vel B, you always look out, friend. <laughs> hey. See, you got your little glasses. You got your little... You want to go back in and get your glasses? I don't need nothing. This is an impromptu, child. I just... Listen, I got on my pajamas. Where your uh, thing you be wearing? Will you see your house? I believe you with them outfits at. Oh, I had that on yesterday. <laughs> My captain. Yeah, captain. Yeah, I had that on yesterday. What would it be without you? Give me a Porsche. Oh, it's the air. Oh. Hold on. It say AC. AC. There you go. I'm coming. 
back in a second. I just want to get you down by the vent my you know that was the only place i could put it that i love this neighborhood over my next house gonna be over here it's for sale mm -hmm. oh you're gonna call jackson you know that's like a white man that wear penny loafers jackson now we're looking at y'all can't hear me press one if you can hear me can y'all hear me Okay. Oh, Larger came in here and said that. I was like, oh. I'm Josh to find him a new house. Hey. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all can hear me. Now we house hunting. Okay. <laughs> now we house hunting. <laughs> you made a left turn and a right turn and a left turn and a right turn. So we ain't know it's in my house. <laughs> what is this person talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know. Um, you hate moving, love decorating. Okay, me too. Me three. You've been on Zillow enough to know that neighborhood. I be on Zillow too. Okay. Every day. One just came on the market. It was like 8.8 .8 million something. Crazy. Sandy Springs is very nice. Springs. We live for Sandy Springs. You can make a right or left, a right or left, a right or left. I like this one right over here. Oh, you like him? Oh, we, we house hunting for real. Oh. This video will be deleted. <laughs> we in the middle of Lenox Square, honey. How do we get over here so fast? Hi, I'm having a good day. How are you? Ooh. I don't like them either, but I know they got a lot of square footage. Uh -huh. I saw one of them that was for sale a little while ago. Just window shopping. Um, that was one thing good about the army. When I moved, they picked up the whole house. You didn't have to do nothing. I haven't got my car back yet. No. Oh, they said it'll be a couple of days. I don't know what they got to do. Whatever they got to do is um, uh, not electrical. What do you call it? Technical. They got to go through the the system and do something. I don't know. They didn't turn it off my phone, so. I don't know what they're doing. When he drove for lift, he went to Sheree's house. Oh. You saw that little bitty man with that big dog. Okay. And that big, big dog with a little yeah. dog. She has a beautiful cane corso. Yeah, I've been seeing that on her social media. That's a big ass dog. Mm -hmm. underground um wiring that's the carrot that's the carrot huh. that's the flip ain't no flip over here yeah when they point is uh, uh hi 
friends. Hi, newbies. I know some of y'all probably don't know who I am, and that's cool. If you know who I am, just go ahead and click that like button and click that subscribe button. And maybe we can get to know each other. But to all of my Ride or Die Squad members, I appreciate y'all too, because you know, I don't, we haven't been doing these kind of lives over here lately. But since we outside, we're just outside. That's why we out here in my pajamas. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. It really should go like right here. Mm -hmm. Doesn't need to be deeper. It's not that deep. Right here. Or right here. Let me try it right here. I got this little new phone holder thing. I got it off TikTok. TikTok make you buy it. Like the ride along with Aaron. I do too. I just say that was good my first one. You want some crap? What we eating today? It can't be no with cute because I got no outcast surprise. <laughs> Georgia does have the best homes. You saw that article that AJC wrote that said that um, the real estate in Georgia is highly inflated. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. And then I saw my friend uh, Wendy was in the Comment section. She was like, you compare that to San Francisco. The houses in Georgia ain't nothing. Okay, San Francisco, Los Angeles, <laughs> and we're in the Bay Area. I feel like it's worth it. Because we got all these corporations down here. Everybody's been here for one reason or another. So, of course, the real estate market is going to go up because there's a lot of people looking for real estate. And that's one thing that doesn't replicate is land.
I'm a Fulton County girl. I'm a Fulton County man. Yeah. Cobb County me, come home, black boy. You have to have a certain amount in your bank account, okay? Yo. Y'all going to Shamley this time of day? Yep. <laughs> No, I thought it was uh big boy. Doom doom doom. Oh, do we need to cut the music off for me online? Oh yeah, turn it down a little bit. That's fine. Am I from Atlanta straight from the A? Straight from the A. Um I don't know where we're going to eat at. We just we not that far here yet. I had my little shrimp salad. Josh had a little protein shake. It's hard to hear. Y'all can't hear me. Oh, but this thing on the this thing on the volume button. Like see Patterson, yes, read straight from the A. Google is your friend. Google straight from the A. Google AT Alien. Google Michelle AT Alien. Google whatever you want to Google to. I don't know. You hear me loud and clear? Thank you so much. I, I, I was thinking, I'm like, do I have to yell? I done turned the uh, vents down. First, the vents were high, and that's all you could hear was, was wind noise. And now it should be fine. the shortcuts you should have went through there. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I want to see the houses through there, but I think it's another They just plop it down in the middle. Yeah. A lot of these houses are really nice. Let's see. That's why I'm in the corner. Uh, Y'all want to see what we're looking at? Uh, I can't even put the thing. Anybody got Porsches? Yep, that's what I got too. Tycon, uh -huh. Fender Macon. Tycoon. You get one real cheap now. You should have. That's what I should have done. That house is nice. That house is real nice. Thank you, baby. Yeah. All right, buddy. Thank you. All right. It's kind of small, though. It looks long. Mm -hmm. That one's for sale. Okay. You said I should get. Uh, I should look get a little bitty house in the middle of nowhere. They you should to sell. You could, because the they depre the depreciation is steep. Mm -hmm. So you could get like a 2022 for like 60 or 70. That's what I was going to do. What color are you going to be? I don't know. You know, I've 
had every kind of car. I have never had a Porsche. I was talking to the man. To the, you should get a Panamera, the new Panamera. I was talking to the man at Porsche, and he was saying that a lot of the, the diehard Porsche enthusiasts mm -hmm. refuse to buy like a Taycan or a Macan, like the electric ones, because oh yeah, I can tell because they are uh, they are addicted to the engine noise. Mm -hmm. okay. Go faster because of the the way it's built. It's the, 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 the wind noise, I mean, the engine noise, and the yeah. roar of the engine that everybody's addicted to. So all the people who be buying, like, what is it, the Caymans and uh -huh. the 911s and all of them, they refuse to go to, like, Taika. You agree with that? I do, too, after I bought it. <laughs> it's fun to drive. It's sexy. It's fully above. Not my Panamera. It just came. My Panamera is fast, even though it's old, but the, the thing about it is I I owned it all them years. <laughs> so, you know, I They're know that, yeah, it was garaged. It wasn't driven. Like it's it's cars with um, that are, you know, my car's aged. They got like 200,000 miles rebuilt engine. Um, it may not be coming directly from, you know, liquid gasoline but it's coming from somewhere mm -hmm. at my back we was going through a tight space press one if y'all can hear me press one if you can hear me okay good no 911 Porsche 911 Porsche that's why I was talking about the car. Yay, we back. Okay. Okay. We have made it to the other side of town. Okay. Oh, we drive fast. We are almost in Shambly. Mm -hmm. Turn right, turn left, turn right, turn left. Boom. We in Buckhead. Boom, we are in Buckhead. I was breaking up. I'm sorry. We back now though, hopefully. Why is telling me to do that? That's so weird. I'm going to do that. Okay. Um, I like the way that they look facing this way. I don't like the way they look facing the other way. Yeah, and then the privacy that don't come with no no real trees in the back or anything like that. Yeah, they need some trees in the front too. Yeah, they're just looking the back. You just look at the park and like up in the garage. That's yeah, too much money for that. Yeah. I was breaking up like a next ten. Kenya Moore hair care. So that's where y'all want. <laughs> then I say that she has security waiting for okay. me. Okay. So. Like, can you pull up? Security. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> hey, Barbados. Thank you for joining. Me. Mm -hmm. Now we are sitting in traffic. Y'all should go over to Roswell Road and go to Chef Rob's. I'll go. Oh. Brown house. Oh, 
can't help it. Now go to the OLG. Wrong road, wrong road. Okay. I talk and drive would be way, way better. <laughs> she, they said she rushing over there now to open up. <laughs> Honestly, we ain't going over there. I really want something to eat. But you have to eat tomorrow. We just gonna drive by there. I don't know what you got to eat for. Wherever we go, I, can, I gotta be, I got Crocs on. And the Jumps. I mean, we gotta get on Jump Clouds. Yeah, but it's different. Is it? I'm a girl. We're supposed to have on clothes. Yeah. Now go to Sizzlers. I don't think we had it. I don't think we know no Sizzlers in. Did they go call security on me? Security! 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 So what you think about Simon putting out all the documents about uh, Portia need to get out of that house? I would just let Portia do the hell she's gonna do and just let the legal system take its course. But ain't that what you doing? I wouldn't put out no documents. No. I wouldn't give a shit about before she got up there. Whatever story she tell, I just make make sure I'm doing my studying on the legal end so she don't let her ass in. Ooh. I just want to process what she wants to do. I just want nobody in my house. You don't know what they doing in your yeah, house. Yeah, you definitely don't want nobody in. But I can sure you got staff. And then her car, his cars are there, like his 10-year-old horses and stuff, yeah. his clothes, like everything is there. No, that's just crazy. Well, I want to know what's going through her head. Let me tell you one thing you got is one time to tell me get out. <laughs> like, I'm that type of person. Like, yes. you got one time to tell me get out, and yeah, we got to work I could not sleep peacefully in a house knowing that Correct. somebody that might not want me there. Correct. And it's not my house, and my name ain't on shit. And also, I'm very careful how I treat people. Like, if I don't want you in my life, I don't want you to be a part of my life, I don't want to, if you bought me, just go. I'm out. I'm leave, I left you, I'm going to leave your property, I'm going to leave your kids who live in the house. I'm just going to move on with my life because I don't want to keep being around you causing you anguish. Because some of I cause you a certain type of anguish. You married me, obviously. Mm -hmm. And I've already hurt you in some type of way. So let me just move on with my life because I don't want to be a part of your life anymore. So to me, no matter what people read or say, I will look at her suspect. There's no way I'm going to play with somebody's feelings. Mm -hmm. I married you, I divorced you within a year or under two years, and now I don't want to leave your house. To me, that just gives her that she has no morals. That's true. I thought about this last night, though, because she acted like there's something in his past that is, like, unforgivable. Like, she didn't know all the stuff that was in his past before, that where everybody was talking about all this stuff. Remember Tisa Tales and all of them doing videos, talking about whatever, whatever. And even he said she was six years old when all this shit happened. So, at the end of the day, I didn't, I didn't live my life as a law-abiding citizen for all these years and now all of a sudden you're going to bring up something that happened when you were six years old if that's her reasoning because again she just now started saying that recently when he put out that um, uh, uh, you know that she had like just left and left blind, you know, blindsided him so I think there's something more I think there's another man involved or I think if she did care about him, if, if I was to give her the benefit of doubt, which I don't believe because of the shade she's been throwing, you know what I'm saying? But if I was to give her the benefit of doubt, what if he had a vasectomy? I said this last night. A vasectomy or something and then tell her that she had been trying to have a baby or something. And then she found out. But that would but still, that wouldn't be like your past and you were supposed to protect P, PJ and I and you did not. That was her statement. Here's the thing. One thing I'm not, I can't rest at the end of the night is if I feel like I'm living with a scammer, uh -huh. I'm going to get me my social security number, everything that I got, and protect it and run. I'm not even trying to stay in his house. If his uh, uh, past is so seedy, you don't feel safe. Most certainly, you're not going to feel safe when you dwell in. First thing you're going to do. Because you don't know who after that man. Correct. The first yeah. thing you do is get the hell out of there. Yeah. So it just gives me more and more that Porsche is full of shit. Anybody <laughs> could breathe through this smoke and scream and look past the public persona that she's putting out, you just have to be intelligent enough to be like, she's full of shit. I, somebody said, I believe she knew and thinks she wrong for leaving him, period. She never loved him. Just his money and lifestyle. But that's the point. Like, his money 
Indian lifestyle is still the same that, as far as we know. Yeah, Portia is the scammer. <laughs> Clearly. She probably did want to give PJ a sibling. I, listen, I told y'all I went back and watched um, Portia's Family Matters. And that was one of the things she was saying that she wanted to have another child quickly. And then Portia and Kenya gonna pretend to be friends. Oh God. I doubt that. Well, I doubt King gonna, but she might give her the first episode or two to that. Like you know, she care about her after that. It's King gonna work so bad to being King. Oh. King and I never got the opportunity to drag her for uh, running off with a married man and all the other stuff. But she left before anybody could crucify her for that. Now she ain't get a return on her investment. Well, if she's sitting in a uh, $7 million house and she ain't got to pay that $30,000 million, $30, mortgage or whatever. One thing I do know about the gig is always up at the wild. <laughs> Never That's ask. what it is. Like I wouldn't want to be in limbo with my child, knowing that I can only live here for a few years. If even if I I can live there, it can only be for a year or two. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like I want to be stable. I'm not just gonna stay somewhere just for the sake of. But don't he gotta come home at some point? Yes. Like it's just, it's, 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 she didn't care about uprooting his kids, right? It's crazy. Another day, another, listen, I could walk up and tug on the door again, but it wouldn't matter, would it? They're still not open. Is that security right there? They're going to lock me up if I go to the door. What time is it? Five o'clock. Oh, Let me walk up here with my, uh, with my Crocs on. <laughs> Somebody said, where the damn hair dryers? <sighs> Just another day in the air. No white people. C L O S E D. They said the hours are 10 to 6, Tuesday through Saturday. What's today's date? Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. It is 4 45 p.m. Guess they didn't have no appointments. They were booked all day and they were tired, so never okay. Yeah, I guess they left early. I don't know. Y'all see, it's live, so where's Team 12 to call me a liar? I ain't. I didn't even want to be on camera this time. I just walked up the shoulder. Um, now try out China white food. That's your sister. Oh, okay. Maybe she doesn't have all the licenses. Um, she waiting for the grand, 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 grand opening. <laughs> Kenya's business is booming. All the books are open wide as the table. No hairstylists at work. Listen. I'm just doing my research. That's all we do. 
I'm going to come out once a week. I'm like the inspector. <laughs> fire marshal. I'm like the fire marshal. I'm going to come by about once a week. I'm going to pop up unannounced. And I'm just going to see if business is being conducted. I'm just saying. I might have wanted something done. I might have needed a facial or something. I don't know. Don't get mad at me because Kenya Moore Hair Care is not in business. Unless there's cameras rolling. Drive down the porch and see if my car will be <laughs> Since we over here, drive down the porch and see what's going on with my car. Nah, you ain't got to do that. I'm just doing it. Drive down and we got to do it. Drive down that way. They will find some meat. Yeah. Find some different things. Yeah. Find some different things. Hmm. We'll call it over here, ain't it? See you next seafood? Yeah. Uh, have you ever gone to at the river hair salon? I have not. You got me this Saturday, Princess AG. What's going on Saturday? We going out to eat. Are we going out to eat? Simon should hire you, Michelle, to watch out for his house. <laughs> Let's do. I drive out of every now and then, pop up. That's Porsche over there. <laughs> Let me on the microphone. She's there. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I have other things to do. I'm just, you know, I'm just being really facetious, honestly. I just did this today because we was here. This is what they call fun shade. Mm -hmm. Fun shade. Does Kenya request for utility to be on when she's doing social media? I told you that's her content creation space. That's why I zoomed in on the, the flower wall. Ain't nothing wrong with it. If it's a content creation space, just say that. Why say people getting their hair done when nobody's getting their hair done? It's 4.45 on a Tuesday. You claim to be open till 6. It's hot here too. It's hot here too. She was talking with Sheree and decided to open summer, spring, fall. <laughs> Can you subscribe to me and maybe I will say hi? Can you click that like button and maybe I will say hello? It is 500 people watching. Hi, Junior. What's up? And why you only got one stylist? Okay, I think she got two now. Well, originally she had Brittany. And then she added two more. I heard she added two more black girls. Because everybody was complaining about her having one Caucasian stylist. And now on the website, the Caucasian stylist name is not there no more. Maybe she couldn't pay her. I mean, if you're not open, you ain't getting no heads to wash. I wouldn't want to work that either. How I'm a booth rent and, and you ain't never open. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Who knows? I love having a chauffeur. Thank you. You have the best day ever, too, friends. I love you, too, friend. You love Portia? Oh, Portia deserves love. We all do. I agree. She needs to stop lying. You said wrong side of the road? What? Wrong road? Wrong road. Kenya is not opening the spot of someone another storyline just like that marriage okay whatever happened to the divorce she was just on the breakfast club saying that the judge had signed off on it had a judge signed off on it that was in december january right what happened to you see the thing is can you keep manipulating people she got one uh controversy after another and it try to make you forget about the other stuff so like this hair spa thing i guess she gonna work and keep pretending that it's open and closed and open and closed and make y'all forget that she ain't even divorced yet. But wasn't even married in the first place. How about that? But just call me the blogger. <laughs> Maybe they are traveling stylists and will come to you. Well, if that's the case, why you need a storefront? Why you need a brick and mortar building with your name on the front? 
Kenya is a legion liar, okay? I saw some video he did. He just did another um, interview. Because mm -hmm. I've never watched all the Reese Tisa stuff. Uh -huh. the, the, the husband. And he just did another interview. And it was the same person he did the first interview with. And apparently he lied so much that the person who did the interview with pulled the receipts from the first interview. And he was saying something different. Who, the uh, Reese Tisa husband? Yes. So how you gonna lie in one interview, do an interview with the same person, and lie about the stuff you said in the first interview? Maybe he forgot. There's the Porsche dealership. Let's see my car. Yeah, there's the Porsche dealership. Yeah, that's 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 the Porsche dealership. Yeah, not you in the back seat. Mark wants half the salon. That's what takes us home. <laughs> oh, maybe, it, listen, I don't know what's going on, but that's crazy. I don't even know. Listen, I shouldn't even waste no more time going up there. I ain't no need. She don't. <laughs> <laughs> that's true, she don't. Maybe she just left. And then the whole team tour is going to be like, oh, you came in the wrong door. waste the gas. It's not my gas. I'm in the loaner car. We just ride it up. Okay. Just racking up the miles, honey. Um, and you ain't never gone over. She is such a liar. I agree. She is such a liar. <laughs> that had two grand openings and no employees. Okay. Paying for a building you is not using. I mean, you know, it's a tax write-off. Yesterday was tax day. I'm sure she had a, a big, huge, major loss. <laughs> I'm just saying. I was following. <laughs> what happened to that one lady from Atlanta that found out her business, her husband was cheated? Oh, that's the, the Gail, um, the Gail lady. We was just talking about her. Um, Claudia Jordan hanging with hanging with the mistress. The mistress is allegedly Claudia Jordan's best friend. And now you be wondering why everybody be dragging Claudia. You was always up behind somebody who was doing dirt, which means you doing dirt too. Mark couldn't get half the house if you don't have a marriage license, okay? That just proves he is a liar, okay? Team Twirl be like, is she really in Atlanta? <laughs> Where is Team Twirl? Team Twirl must don't live here because Team Twirl can go up here and see for themselves. I don't know if Andy stepped down. Some of y'all was telling me that earlier. On this Nation, the brat said, RHLA is already filming. I mean, if the brat know, the brat know more than the people know, then I don't know. Does the brat own the Real Housewives of Atlanta? She had to find something to open for that PPP loan. <laughs> Claudia is always attached to something nefarious. Exactly. He's nefarious. Nefarious. Definitely. heard that Andy is supposed why y'all keep telling me about Andy I don't know they they told me Sherelle World said that but I haven't heard it but if, if it's you know if it's true she said it you take me to the porch village no because then they gonna be like did they open they don't even look like they open they got open no I don't want to go over there <laughs> I don't see my car. That's that man with them big teeth right now. He had that blue suit on. The audience wants a gay couple on Real Housewives. No. Who is the audience? No, no, no. Who said that? Um, Michelle has Bravo selected and announced the women. I, I haven't heard anything. Yes, we are live, Mara. We just went to Kenya Moore's hair care. If you can rewind, rewind it. I might clip it out, might not. It don't matter. They ain't never there. And now we are headed in the opposite direction. <laughs> the 
they just got rid of big gay candy. He's so dumb. <laughs> not big gay candy. <laughs> well, we know who not filming in Simon's house. Okay, 2000. Unless she's using her um her cell phone. Maybe she found a way around it. Maybe Bravo can't film, but she can film with her phone. And you see she keep doing content. Well, hell, they know a film in Claudia's house, so it's easy to get around. Claudia didn't have no house. That's, there we go. So Portia ain't got one either, so they ain't got to film. She just showed up the rest uh, of the But they filmed in, in Claudia's apartment. Remember, with all her cats. I bet it's stinking well, now. Well, you know, she'll sit down and film with her mama. She'll go to her mama's house and film over there. Hire someone that's suing them. I need Nene back. Okay, I need Nene back for real. Y'all yeah, think Nene really gonna do? You think Nene really gonna do a talk show? That's what they said. On Zeus. I don't know about that. That's what Perez Hilton said. And then he was all racial about it, talking about Zeus is is it's like black entertainment television. It's black. It's black. I mean, a chick's a chick, but they ain't come from Zeus. Yeah, that's Zeus. true. That's true. And if they paying good, and shit. the same way she built Bravo, maybe she could build Zeus. Mm -hmm. Like they've already built like a, a audience. <laughs> right. Now they can kind of switch it, you know, and rebrand and do something else. I, right. I, you know, I would hope. I don't know. You want to see Josh? He driving. I keep hearing the phone around because the way this phone thing. There you go, right now. Yeah. Look at the camera saying, hey, Josh. Hello. Yeah, you almost see them. He doesn't match him. Okay. I am hungry, though. Oh, no. It's got to be somewhere like. Take you to say that. I need to go back. I wonder if they do shots. They probably did on them. I'm spending all this money. They can be giving, giving it to me for free. I don't think any fits the Zeus demographic. I agree with that. I don't think she does either. However, maybe, you know, maybe they can build another demographic. You never know. You don't think so? I think she do. <laughs> that's shade. Though. No, and that's no shade. Because with he, Natalie Dunn and and what's the other dude's name? I don't even know. But all of them people, really? All the fight girls naked? But here's the thing. Nene can go jump. I just feel like she is. I mean, Bravo was doing the same thing, just old women. It's just younger girls. Okay, they dragging people across the stage. Portia drug uh, King across the stage. Uh, people going to jail. Uh, Teresa then went to jail. Like Teresa pushed Andy. This the same shit. Just older people. This younger, uh, younger people. I feel like the same people. Okay. That's my personal opinion. You said you might watch Nene put the paws on someone. I don't think Nene would put the paws on. Nobody. I think they, just the way they was fighting. Nene around got her. a mouth. I don't think she got hands. Yeah, I think the same way they like. I don't think it, they would take her that way. I just feel like you know. Hey Jen, rewind a little bit. No friend, the shop is not open. It wasn't open today anyway, not when I got there. We got there at 4.45 p.m. on a Tuesday. According to her website, they're open from 10 to 6. That's it, that's all. I've been on an hour and a half, a bit. Anyway, maybe I'll give y'all 30 more minutes. Uh, all Claudia's friends are down with OPP. <laughs> yeah, you know me. <laughs> Not down with OPP. Child. Listen, Claudia got a sketchy past herself. I don't care what she says. That, that thing right there is something else. Not that thing right there. That thing right there is something else. A whole entitled Karen. Cosplay it as a black woman. I cannot take it. Uh, 
but Nene is older, so the younger people are on Zeus. So it's different demographics. That's what I said, Radius. That's why I'm like, I can see like her, if it's announced that she would get like a talk show or something on, on that network, I can see her bringing people over there. Like people maybe subscribing because they want to see like any interview Denzel Washington or somebody. You know, I don't know. But I don't know. It would have to be different than what they're doing now, in my opinion. Because right now, I don't see where she would fit in. And I, I was subscribed to Zeus for a year and then he watched it. They had that conversation thing, which was kind of okay, but I didn't even watch that because of the people on it. I felt like if they got some other people on it, it would have been okay. And I did that at, at the suggestion of my squad. And I was just trying to support a pet business by buying a year of Zeus. I think it was like $56 or something. I watched it maybe once or twice and didn't watch it at all. My friends love it and I'm the 35 over crowd. Mm -hmm. So that's the Nene's crowd. They love Zeus. Yes. What they love about it? They just, I, I don't know how. They just like it. I feel like she was great over there. I think that's shade. No, no, that's not shade. I really do think she would do great over there. Nene is almost, I ain't going to say her age, but that's shade. But we grew up watching her. I, my first time watching her, I was like my last year high school. Mm. And so we went on the journey. That's with just her. like saying we bring in, we bring in Wendy Williams to Zeus. Oh, that'll be everything. Do you know how, how many people <laughs> watch Wendy Williams on Zeus? And that way she ain't got the network saying she can't say certain words. Uh -huh. It would, Zeus would be an empire surpass Netflix if they brought a Wendy Williams and Nene Leaks up there. If okay. Nene Leaks, I feel like she could pull it off and it would be great. Okay. I really do. But if y'all think that's shade, I think it would be a great opportunity. Mm -hmm. The only reason I watched Baddest Reunion was to see Nene's reaction to different things. You watched the reunion? Yes, just because here's the thing. It's Nene. Her was it good? I didn't because Nene, but oh, no, no, I know you're not like her, it's her reactions <laughs> to stuff. But now I know, damn, okay, she gonna knock the bitch out. Like, now you got me wanting to watch it. It's her, it wasn't that Nene had great long term monologues, uh -huh. it was her mannerisms that just made you be like, this bitch is naturally funny. She didn't do them 30 minute reads like Phaedra that was practiced for like three, four days straight. Mm -hmm. It was just uh, like Nene was told, I know damn well that dress ain't got you thinking no shit like that when she was twer going with the world fabric. She's like, let me go get my damn wine. Like just short little things that you know that made it funny. Okay. It was just, I mean, to me, that's what me and my crowd watched and I don't know what y'all ladies did. Excuse me. My crowd. Yeah, like, you know, the ladies, you know, for me, you know, we thought it was funny. Okay. Zeus, Nene hosting Zeus was funny. She was just like, y'all think Natalie, Long, Natalie has the power over here when she's uh, just an executive producer. She doesn't run everything. Mm -hmm. Y'all giving her too much power. Like, y'all going off on her and she just uh, a title head figure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Everybody saying they think Nene would be good. They agree with you. But her own show, that's what I was thinking. It have to be like her own show. Put her own baddest. Let her be the house mother. Not on Why she the house mother? Let her, she be the house mother. Lord, I can't take She go there sitting there. You cannot put your hands on nobody else. <laughs> Listen. Listen. Can you imagine any time you, you cannot put your hands on nobody else? No. You know how Monique had charm school? Yes. If Nene had a charm school, that made Monique a bigger star when she did charm school. You think so? Yes, because it brung her in the living rooms of people who didn't watch uh, what the Parkers. So it introduced her to another crowd, I think, to be a major uh, celebrity. Did we call here last time they was closed? Are they still here? Oh, shit. Let's go see. I don't remember, but I will see. You might be right. Because remember we came up here last time and we was like, damn, our spot gone. Yeah, I forgot about that. We can go to Taco Man. Damn show is. Then it used to be that, right? No, maybe. This one on Roswell Road. Okay, it's one over there by my house, over there off of. Show is. Well, not my. <laughs> you know, over there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It used to be one by your house. Yeah. Okay, let's move on now. 
you you must really want to stay. I just want to ride. Yeah, you just want to ride. So we just ride. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm starving. I want to stop at McDonald's. <laughs> I want to stop so bad. Can you stop and give me a milkshake or some <laughs> shit? My ass is hungry. I had nothing to eat but that damn shrimp salad. <laughs> I want some. Let's go to our. Um... We go wherever. Go to the, where we're going. Just let's get there. <coughs> Let's go to our spot, P.F. Chase. Not like this. What's I the cannot go, I cannot walk in there like this because I guarantee you I'm going to see somebody I know and they're going to be looking at me like, this bitch go out the house looking like this. It's a closer one. I'm going to find one. <laughs> I went to wash my car the other day and I was looking so right. Well, I don't think I was, I was, I was looking okay. But I don't think I was looking my best. Uh -huh. And I saw uh, one. I don't see salt. Oh. <sighs> he wanna hug and talk and oh god. I like one. He's a nice guy. Um not my love. What are you talking about? What's wrong with how you look? Uh I got a little house dress. <laughs> Like dress like you know i just like you know if i if i go i just, you know i'd be putting i got a little house dress like i literally just threw this little house dress on this little house dress that would be so you don't think monique being i mean not monique nini being like charm school style with uh that would be like so good with those baddies that would be cute i guess i i, I see that need somewhere with a booth i that's what i was thinking that's why we were going to Outback, but it's closed. It's not here no more. It's gone. It's gone with the wind. I ain't Taco Man in a long time. I wouldn't want the Taco Man. Oh, we're going to Taco Man. You didn't want Taco Man. I just. We can go to Outback. Go where we going. You said you're going to drive. Go there. Okay. It's about 80 here. I don't know. It's hot. That's for sure. Damn, so hot. What did I say? 66. That's what I'm Damn, so Were you ever invited to join a reality show? No, I'm, I've never been invited to it, and I never would anyway. They know not to ask me because I would say no. Actually, Jason Lee was working on something and he was begging me to participate, and I went. This was a while ago. Um, my charm school was everything. Oh, okay. Hey, Sky Manels. Charm school. Friend. You know what, Sky Manels? I got your lip gloss in my purse. I was just using it. Where you go? I might have left that one there. I was just using your lip, lip gloss. Yes, yeah, Greasley. Yep, look at that. Sky my nails, thank you so much. I would like her to do something with a with successful ladies and produce more shows. I would really to say stuff out loud then y'all be like you're a neat hater but y'all know I can never be that but I just really would want her to get the courage to step out on her own instead of being under somebody else's thumb and I feel like she has the capability to do that but a lot of times when people come from structured businesses i.e. entertainment and stuff like that like they don't know how to build a brand on their own like they need a team or they need you know what I mean and so I feel like you know that's where she is like without a team she's kind of lost and I feel like you know sometimes you have to be your team you have to put you know the effort into yourself and yeah and and and, and build and grow and you know everything else comes this is my opinion you know I'm, I'm my, opinion. my opinion bears no weight whatsoever she has more power and that's what i i think I, I really do i have some great friends i like even Derek j i just said the same thing about him like <laughs> i just feel like you just you just underestimate the power of your influence and you keep going and keep going You're yeah right. <laughs> yeah and you got a fan base and your fan base will support you you know, no matter how big or small, like people be looking at my fan base like, oh, she ain't got a million, she got this, but I got a supportive fan base. You know what I'm saying? And so I feel like, the, and I don't even consider them fans, I consider them family. 
And I just feel like when, when people genuinely support you, then, you know, succeed. yeah, you have no option but to succeed and grow and build, you know. And I know she has a strong, you know, fan base. Like, Nene, come on. And that's international. So, Greg was her team. Exactly. Greg was her team. But she also, and that's what I mean. Like, she kind of, you know, she also had a team being like the big one of the biggest stars or the biggest star at the time at Bravo. She had a team over there. Like, they had a whole PR powerhouse. That's how she knows when people are doing things to smear her name and this kind of thing or putting fake stories out to the media and she knows that because you know she had a whole pr team over there protecting her and she knows when it it flipped you know so not the guy sound like carlos king no he don't followers do not matter if they do not engage what you say i say that all the time like i always bring up like I hate to keep saying like Trey Song or somebody like that, but look at somebody who has, or a singer, or a songwriter, who has like millions of, of followers, and they can't sell a million records. They can't sell a percentage of that. You know what I mean? And 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 to the the novice social media person, they would look at that and be like, oh, that person making all the money. They got a million subscribers. No, you're right. And they ain't making nothing. I know a lot of That's why you see a lot of these people and no shade they're just hilarious and I, but you see a lot of these people like that who has like huge fan bases or, or huge followers who really want to get into something like, you know, the Breakfast Club or T V or whatever to make more money because they're not making that kind of money on, on social media. And they also be buying them now too. They do be buying they be buying them. Like some of these celebrities do not have all of these followers like I hate to call some Atlanta girl names, but they just not have it. There's no way a Toya Bright got all them type of followers. But Toya was on TV too. BET? Ain't no wrong with BET. Girl, no ma'am. No ma'am. Mimi was on Bravo, an international. She is an icon. And what, Toya has more? Yes. Because she, but because of her daughter <laughs> and because of Little Wayne. What is, what is, what? You got to think of all the associations. It's, it's multi-layered. They ain't, they ain't that interested. It ain't, I'm not buying it. I'm just not buying it. They said Candy got all these followers and only five people tuned into the show. That's Candy another got one. 10 million followers. They, all the tickets better be sold out. Here. Okay, that's another one. Like, y'all, I just be feeling like it's a bunch of bullshit. Mm. 12.6. Are you kidding me? Okay. But she's likable. She's a New York Times bestselling author. Oh, girl. It takes 30 books to be a New York Times bestseller. Hey, why you hate I'm not hating. I'm just being like realistic. Like, come on. This, how, this, how we end up with you? <laughs> this is how I also understand what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I've gone to some of the parties that people pay them to host. Mm -hmm. Nobody shows up. Mm -hmm. You remember we was telling you that we went to our friend thing the other week, mm -hmm. and we paid whatever, mm -hmm. and it was like, and they got all these followers, mm -hmm. and y'all do all these things. But you gotta think too, if you're doing stuff locally, all your followers ain't in the same city. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I just, I don't know. I'm not but, bad. You know, and then even people who do like mean greets and, um, uh, you know, little one off shows and stuff like that, like a lot of them be banking on getting a percentage of their, their fan base to show up. And a lot of times it's, it's a smaller percentage than y'all think. Like y'all be thinking it's like a lot. It's like well, if I could get at least four percent of my subscriber base, then I make this kind of money. It's like y'all is it even worth it? I don't know. I even go to be honest with you. Even when it comes to like the Kardashian that have all these followers, mm -hmm. it don't equal out to well, you can't compare the Kardashians because they, they're, they're, they're they got ratings. like their social media team. Not even the ratings, but like their followers spend money. You know, they got all these products, skims, and 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 Kylie cosmetics, and you know what I mean. Like, but they, even look at the numbers of Kylie cosmetics; it's consistently declining. It's not what they be reporting. Hmm. Like, they don't be reporting real numbers. When you look at like the numbers that companies who actually own them or invest in them, they're not the like the real numbers. 
they all their press is to be we're so successful, we're so rich. That's their that's that, their their monster scams. That's their you know, I don't their image. Mm -hmm. Their everything they touch turns into gold. But that clothing line Cali uh Cali Jenner came out with, mm -hmm. it quickly closed down. It didn't do well. The same with Beyonce, you know. She did Yeah, Beyonce. Like, it's uh, interesting. She'll sell tickets. I yeah, mean, concert tickets. Concert tickets. But when you know, she always has a product. Like even with the Adidas line and stuff. Yeah. Like her fans are. are buying them, and they seem to sell mm -hmm. out. But it's like they they go to the wayside. Mm -hmm. Like right after the novelty wears Where off, off, nobody no is continuously buying. Mm -hmm. You know, the Adidas and the this and the that. I like the Adidas. Stuff. No, I mean, I, I, I have friends that bought that stuff too, her stuff too, but I just don't feel like, you know. Oh, like, look how they wearing Jennifer Lopez out right now. They wear her out. Oh, Jennifer Lopez. And she got all the followers. Why they wear her out? Because she had the gun that, that did it. Well, <laughs> she had that movie she spent $20 million on. Nobody watched it. Oh, not $20 million. Of her own money. Nobody watched it. Like, a lot of her clothes and stuff always went down. Area back yesterday. Along with um baby fat jeans. Apple bottom. Apple bottom. Boots with the fur. Yup, oh. Rockin' wet ladies. Y'all done with Sean John. Beyonce's hair care products will do good. I mean, I, I think so. a lot of her products do good because, again, she has a loyal fan base. However, when you think about it, is it is the consistency? Like the novelty is gonna wear out. Yeah, you're gonna buy it when it first, you know, lunch or whatever because you want to support Beyonce. But are you gonna keep buying it? Is right. this gonna be a staple in your right. everyday? In like your Rihanna everyday made a staple. Yeah, this is a staple in your everyday wardrobe. Are you gonna use this hair care product daily? You know, like consistent over the years. Like Rihanna killing it with Fenty. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, did you watch um, Coachella? No. Oh, I was watching it. It was so good. I didn't even realize I was a Doja Cat fan. Oh, I don't like Doja Cat. You don't like yeah, Doja Cat? Like Some of her lyrics are very witchcraft. -y. Yeah, well, they are. Yeah, I don't know. But I didn't realize I knew so many songs. <laughs> I was jamming. It was so good. I watched it live on YouTube. Doja Cat goes hard. She really does. I was like, and then she had little dance moves and stuff, and little dances and the, the damn costume changes. I was just getting my life. Uh, there are a lot of bot accounts following people, even if they don't pay for them. Bot accounts will follow random people. Wow, they do. I guess. Doja Cat Cat is witchcraft. Yeah, a lot of her lyrics, I don't know, no ma'am. Well, maybe I need to listen to more, but I was still scared. It was a good performance. I am feeling wonderful today. Thank you for asking, friend. Did they take away my... No, he's charged my car over there. I don't know if they took it away. Yeah, that concert was really good. It was worth watching. I was surprised. I was like, oh, what is this? Let me look. Because I just, you know, clicked it when it came up on my, um, whatever I was looking at, Apple TV or whatever. And the Coachella was on. I was just trying to see who was on stage at the time. And it was Doja. And I think she had just started. Maybe she had been on for a little while. But I watched that whole thing. It was like a good hour or two. Y'all keep coming in here late asking the same question. I'm going to ignore the hell out of you. Oh. <laughs> I'm just saying, we've been on for like a good hour and a half. Then you come in at the tail end and ask what we talked about at the beginning. That is so annoying. They need a recap. Well, they need to rewind. <laughs> uh, well, I, we, we had decided on Outback. I guess we decided on a steak and a blooming onion, but our Outback that we normally go to is not there anymore. So now we're going to oh, no. another. Another. Location. Location. Mm -hmm. You know, you can rewind.
like put your finger down at the bottom and scooch it over like this. To rewind. I do that a lot. I'll rewind and I I would prefer a lot of times when I come in alive, I would prefer to rewind because then I can watch it fast. Put on fast speed, y'all. Y'all be talking too slow. <laughs> oh, I hate listen. That, I thought you would never say that. I hate watching a live video. I like to watch it later and then speed it up. I'm like, okay, let's get to the point. Uh-huh. Uh, no, it's a Porsche Macan. It's a little, a little Porsche Macan. It's a little loner car. It's just running the, running the miles up. It had 70 miles on it when I got it. How many got now? 128. Uh, 115. No, uh, 128. No, you're right. 128. Okay. It had 60 miles on it when I got it. Now it's got 128. Let me see if I can get to 1,000. Okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Mama, we on our way. I know, right? <laughs> No, they had me sign. They said I can't take it out of town. Oh, that's what they said? Yeah. It's well, got what, out of town to you and them with two different yeah, things? Yeah, that's true. I, ain't gonna, I don't want to be charged no, for it Because they, they, they're going to tell me they got a track in my car. I don't care. I got a track in my car, too. You know, uh, that I did. You know when I had a BMW a convertible? My car was in the shop. Uh -huh. I kept the car for a month. And um, they charged me for new tires. Uh -huh. Like, it was a bunch of stuff they charged me for. What they charge for new tires? Girl, I want them tires out there. I took the car to North Carolina. It was convertible. I took that thing to beat. How they gonna charge you for the loaner car when? Because they told my car ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you kept the car kept the despite car. your car being ready. So uh -huh. you was a scammer. Yeah, I kept the car for like another week because I heard I had my vacation plan with convertible. <laughs> I don't want to drive my car. So I'm like, girl, I'm gonna take this convertible. Sound like, sound like something you do. I'm, I'm gonna take this convertible and I'll see you girls when I get back. You know what? And then when I got back, they were like, the tires are worn. And then I said, what is the cheap ass tires? Uh huh. But they wouldn't give me my car back until I paid for uh -uh. Yep, the tires. They held stuff. your yes, car hostage. Yes, they did. So I thought I was going to be sleek. I'm, I'm going to drop the car off after hours when I get off of work. <laughs> <laughs> and I just paid for my car to think, but no, that wasn't going to work for them. If I started saying I couldn't go out of town because I was driving that loaner every day where I had it for three months. What? Yeah, they, 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 this is the first time I've seen that though. Cause normally when you get a loaner, they don't like say all that, you know what I mean? So I guess now they got hip to the game and they talk about no pets, no this, no that, oh, no this, no smoking. No yeah. I get to no smoking, but no pet. You yeah. crazy. You know them white people to get them porches, not gonna go without their pets. Yeah. They can get them no problems. You know, Big in the backseat, surprise. <laughs> but um, I would prefer my car. You don't like uh, um, I don't need to ride SUVs. I don't like SUVs, period. That's correct. I know. I feel like a soccer mom, like picking up everybody's kids. Why you like SUVs? I like all cars. I, like I, like the, I like the I like the roof. I don't have a range. I don't have everything. And I like the fact that the roof opens. You know, do it. I wish that it opened all the way. Oh, yeah. yeah. But then I don't like it now because like when it's closed, you can see out of both of them. Now you can't. It's good lighting. I need a haircut so bad. I think you're taking pictures. Yeah, I take a picture every day. You know mm -hmm. Every day I take a picture of myself. And then it's got the little thing right here that Light skin and you don't like sun, you do this, you do this right here. You see it, Jack? I put on sunblock if you don't like sun, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't ride around like this. I Y'all feel like, claustrophobic, yeah. Mm -hmm. you like. Girl, the light green, what the hell she doing? And I'm 20 cars behind blowing a horn, sound like road rage. Like, she's a no, oh, like Lord, don't fast. kill me. Go, honey. Lord, and I missed the damn light, and I'm hungry. It's time to go. We've been on for two hours. See, I like her. She went on. She know what the deal is. You are, you are, you are right. hangry. You don't sit no light like this. And you gonna take a blind ass too. Oh, you go. Oh, it's your birthday. Happy oh. birthday. Blessings to you, Miss Joyce. 
blessing to you. God bless I hope you. you do something fun. I hope you have minimal likes. Amen. Birthdays, not Amen. likes. Birthdays. Right. He ain't going to be on the news with me in the car. Well, he might be. I might be fighting him. The car might have closed in the back. <laughs> don't waste another bite. Oh, my energy just depleted. Like all of a sudden, it just went. Are hey, you hungry? You don't eat enough. And then shrimp salad. I wish I had a protein shake or something. I got nothing. I ain't got no snacks in my pocketbook. About to eat five minutes away. <laughs> He's normally a nice guy. He a little hangry right now. I don't know how we ended up all around the world. I, I, I. Yeah, we did, didn't we? Been around the world, I, I, I. I can't talk about that, man. Baby, you know where, uh, that, um, Envy Whitney Houston, Whitney Weezer. She said, I've been around the world. She said, Whitney, I heard you was a trip. She said, I've been around the world, and I, I, I. Yeah. Uh, that's one of my favorite. I gotta watch, rewatch that. Oh, my God. I watch it at least once a month. Like, <laughs> well, I ain't know if they. You out here in the middle of the street? Oh, you better be glad ain't nobody coming through the crosswalk. Somebody could, uh, oh, somebody could, they could get a ticket. Uh, what is the man behind you doing? I don't know. I can't see behind me. Y'all tell me what he doing. He probably mad because he thought Josh was going to go since he out here in the middle of the street. Well, I don't want to run no light and they take a picture of your plate and force to you to Well, it ain't got no cameras. They got parents in this area. Yeah, yeah the pump man couldn't even get in the dead uh, <clears throat> crosswalk. Couldn't them in the crosswalk. That's what I told you. Well, this one, I'm not in the mouth. Oh, we could go to, uh, what well, they ain't open. Killer Burger. Let's go and go to Outback. Go and go to Outback. Go and go to Outback. Because they ain't open because people would be sitting outside if they were, wouldn't they? They close down for good, don't they? No. That interview with Wendy and, and uh, Wendy was iconic. Iconic. Was, <laughs> the best. A lot of Wendy's interviews were iconic. Baby, ain't nothing funny that time she locked to me got a damn studio. Oh, Lord. <laughs> yeah, that was wrong. <laughs> That was wrong. Yeah, but Tamika was all in her ear trying to spill the tea. Didn't get to the studio. Don't want to spill nothing. She was like, you can go. <laughs> Wendy Williams said, I saw this. <laughs> 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 that shit was funny as hell. And she said, oh, now you want to get her be shy? Oh, no. She got to go. Okay. She would have had something else. I would have. She had that Aston Martin that got repossessed. You said that's enough for her. I'm sure she got something else by now. They do drive very bad out here. Uh, I know two other black, I know a black girl, I know a black guy. Because the reason I started liking was because my attorney had, I think he had a, he might have had it. That's a caveman right there, right? Mm -hmm. Might have had that first. They just too hard to get in and out of. Yeah. Any size. Like then tall, he had short. that convertible 911, <laughs> and then he had. Now he got something else. I don't know yet. But he always had a uh, the newest port, a good Porsche. I'm like, get me a Porsche. Then I got me a Panamera, and then I fell in love with him after that. Cause you was a Mercedes girl. Your girlfriend has a Porsche and my aunt. No, I, I was just being facetious, Lou. I'm just being facetious. Only because, you know, when, I, when I'm when i out, it's the old white man. I'm not saying that it's not possible, Williams. I'm not saying that at all. 
when I come on at night, it's normally the same time all the time. It's normally at 10. White man. White man. Mm -hmm. Yup. <laughs> Candy says she can't spend like she used to on Amazon. I like, know she can't. <laughs> she ain't fooling nobody. When is the monthly IG live? <laughs> Good question. I haven't been on live on Instagram in a minute. I'll go over there. I'll go over there soon. Y'all know I have to uh, recharge my social battery when it comes to, to live. I don't know why. Joyce Old School Music be jamming the staple singers. We already passed by the spot, Miss Scorpio. Rewind this video about 45 minutes because it was 445. It's 530 okay. now. It was 445. We went by there. Uh, the chassis, chassis, chassis. Let me go up and down. I don't like the way that looks. People could just hit the, the like button. It is so free, Joyce. I'm just saying, it is free. I think we're going to Outback if we ever get there. We're going. We're on our way now. They said, Josh, will you be on live with me? If I'm invited, if I don't feed us up, we might kill each other. We might kill us. Kill yeah, each we other. might kill each other because I am getting a little grouchy. I've been grouchy. I don't blow the whole. I know. he been the speed and slamming on brakes and stuff. I'm like, I'm going to be a whole no. That's why y'all don't see me. <laughs> I'm over here holding on, oh, honey. Now we back in traffic. We always jump in traffic and then be in a rush. <laughs> Outback seems out the way. It sure do. It's out the way. <laughs> <laughs> it was. Listen. It was in our way when we when we forgot that it was closed. The one we used to go to. Get the shrimp for an appetizer. Child, I'm getting some. I'm getting the appetizer. I'm getting the <laughs> entree, and I might even get a dessert. Not a piece of cheesecake. They said cheesecake. I thought I don't know what kind. Of, I want a little chocolate, some a little whipped cream on it. The mousse. A little mousse. <laughs> don't have your steak dip. Why did a woman kneel down in a grocery store because she was looking for low prices? Not you coming up here with the dad jokes. <laughs> That's funny. I'm going to keep that one in my middle of Rolodex. That's in the middle of them. <clears throat> we 
You don't. You need to start a whole new channel, Cooking with Michelle. <laughs> if you are not a member, if you all the members, y'all can go watch my Cooking with Michelle video. I posted earlier today. I was cooking. I actually cooked last night. So if you are a member, please, please, please watch it. Um, this is it right here. See if I can find it. Look, this is it right here. Cook with me. It is currently members only. I was cooking last night. Cooking me good old shrimp dish. Yes, cook it with Michelle. Yes, cook it with Michelle. So, y'all go watch it. Members only. And Patreon members. I do some videos of your favorite Atlanta restaurants. Okay, I might do that. I might do that. We could do that. We could do that. Outback won't be on that, though. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, Outback won't be on that. Uh, this is a lane club, this one. You love the cooking meal. Thank you, Toria. <laughs> it's good. It's really good after, like, the next day when the, the lime juices, lemon juices, like, marinate that cucumber. That, oh, it's so good. And it's a good, like, snack. That's why I, I should have ate some for a little bit. A good, light little dish. Yes, the perks of being a member. You could be a member too of this channel. I think the lowest price is like a dollar ninety nine. So it's low. It ain't. It's not expensive at all. Then your name is green in the chat, and you get special emoji videos. See, Patterson, I gotta give you an honorary membership or something. I gotta figure out how to do. Are you a member, of C. Patterson? Where did Joe go after stepping on a minefield everywhere? Ah. It's so funny. Anyway. Oh yeah, the, the ones on the other channel is only 99 cent. Only 99 cent. What'd you get from me, Tony Mitch? Did I miss something? Duck salad. Oh, that duck salad was good. I don't know how to make it though, but it was good. I got that in uh, Miami at uh started with a K. Some Japanese restaurant. It was so good. Not the OLG game. I would never go to the OLG game. No, no shade to candy. I would try the best, but I just won't be going. <laughs> you don't like duck? Oh. is hell. How we get here? Oh, it's, it's 5.30. It's 5. And then they got a lane for a little bit. You know I was about to do that. I was just about to do that. <laughs> From, you know, over here. This real one, let's see. Let's see if we can make it over there. A few routes. Okay, let's see. You can go the back way. Let's okay. see. It's still traffic on Cheshire Bridge, but once you pass that, oh, you know what? Let's take it back that way up there. Okay. We 
Let's see. It say 18 minutes. Oh, it's still a long time. All right, my battery's about to die. Does the car cut off at lights to save gas? Yes, it does. But I don't have it on right now. There you go, right there. this phone that phone about I'm about to cut off thank you so much Joyce I appreciate your friend hey some of them y'all go ahead and re-watch this video uh, until I decide that I might uh, put it on members only we've had an excursion today we've been on for over two hours we went to visit Kenya Moore's hair care and we rolled all around the world I I I I <laughs> I'll see y'all tonight Bye, my love. I'm like Monique. Where's the where's the off button? <laughs>